Bible book summary cards were born out of a desire to help students know, in a basic way, the content and themes of each book in the Bible. In a nutshell, what is in the book of Genesis? What is the book of Exodus about? Can you tell me what the book of Obadiah is about? How about the Gospel of John, the letter of Ephesians? Wouldn't it be great for our students to have a basic understanding of each Bible book? You might be saying, I wish I had a basic idea of what was in every book of the Bible. Well, you can with the Bible book summary cards. On the front of each card is an illustration that represents the main content and theme of a book. On the back is a brief summary of the book and questions that you can ask your students when you are reviewing through each card. For example, this card represents the book of Ezra. On the back is a brief summary of the book that basically tells us that in the book of Ezra, King Cyrus of Persia let the Jews go home from Babylonian captivity and rebuild the temple. Some of them did, and a priest named Ezra taught them the law of Moses. In a simple way, this is illustrated on the card and it really helps students remember what Ezra is about. There are also questions on the back that you can ask when reviewing the card, like, what Bible book does this card represent? What does the book of Ezra tell about? What king let the Jews go home? Who was Ezra? Here is the book of Galatians illustrated. You see the brief summary on the back that tells us that Paul was upset with the church in Galatia for believing a different gospel than what he had preached. Some people were saying that you had to obey the law of Moses to be saved. But Paul said that Christians are saved by faith in Jesus, not by obeying the law of Moses. Now, does that mean that we can live any way we want to? No, we must live by the Spirit and not by the flesh, focusing on what God wants and not what we want. There are also questions that you can ask when reviewing the book. In this way, we can learn what all the books of the Bible are basically about. These cards, of course, can be used at any time as a standalone activity, but they are also woven into the Bible Study Guide curriculum. The student pages from primary level on up through advanced level will point you to the Bible Book Summary cards in almost every lesson.